Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. There's just something about that name, Master, Savior, Jesus, like the fragrance after the rain. Jesus, 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 let all heaven and earth proclaim. Shall all pass away, yet there's something about that name. Jesus, the mere mention of his name can calm the storm, heal the broken, raise the dead. At the name of Jesus, I've seen sin-hardened men melted, alcoholics transformed, and the lights of hope put back into the eyes of a hopeless child. At the name of Jesus, hatred and bitterness turn to love and forgiveness. Arguments cease. I've heard my own wife softly breathe that name at the bedside of one of our children, delirious from fever. And I've watched that little body grow quiet and the fevered brow cool. I've sat beside a dying saint my own dear sweet grandmother who gave me a home when I didn't have a home. And I've heard her summon with her last ounce of ebbing strength to whisper Earth's sweetest name, Jesus, Jesus. Emperors have tried to destroy it. Philosophies have tried to explain it away. And tyrants have tried to wash it from the face of the earth with the very blood of those who claimed it. Yet still it stands. There shall come that final day when every voice that has ever uttered a sound, every voice of Adam's race shall stand and in one great mighty chorus proclaim the name of Jesus. For God's book says in that day, every knee shall bow and every tongue shall confess that Jesus is Lord. So you see, it wasn't just by mere accident that the angel almost 2,000 years ago appeared to Mary and said, his name shall be called Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. There is something about that name. Kings and kingdoms, they're gonna all pass away. But that wonder, 